Hello, and welcome. I'm Zinder, and uh, I've got a really cool sword now. Check that out. But if you're wondering what's with all the materials in my inventory, remember when I said we weren't going to build this project over here? Well, I lied. I lied because my cows have kind of disappeared. There weren't a tree up there, and uh, it's kind of irritating me. We've got these two set out here. Um, I'll show you what these are for. Three, four, five, six, seven. I think that's seven. Yes. We are going to actually build the barn at least partly today. Uh, because I definitely want to make sure I have, like, the pens and stuff for the cows. Let's see. Okay. Thinking. I wanted four. Oh. Ah. That's that's no fun. The way these blocks place at times can be very finicky. There. Now this is going to be where the doorway, the actual doorway into here is going to be. Like I have a whole general plan, like it's not there's not going to be, you know, super any any super amazing designs or anything with this place. It's just going to be a barn. Uh Hmm. And that should be, yep, that is four wide. I filled in all the holes around here. And if you're wondering why this space is back here, it's because I'm going to get this lever and I'm going to run the... You bastard. I'm going to run them across the, the beams that are going to be across the top of this. Whoops. Oh, hi. Um. God damn it. Uh, you have no idea how many times I've done that. But to anyhow, I originally tried recording this once before, but... I made a uh, small mistake, and Mike was muted. But I wanted to redo the uh, the way it was built a little bit, so I ended up just tearing the whole thing down, and now I'm re-recording it. So fun, fun there. Now, I don't... Actually, yeah, I'm going to... Is there... Why is there no easy way to do things? Two, three, four, four. Three. Uh... So, yeah, I may have partly known what I was doing, but it doesn't mean I actually knew entirely what I was doing with this. Okay, so... I think what I'm gonna do... One, two, three, four, five... Four... Is basically the... Yeah, I'm not entirely sure. I think... I don't like the beams going through the middle. Definitely, I think, going to go like this. And then I'm going to put the, the levers for the different automatic farms uh, right here on the redstone along the top. Speaking of automatic farms, I harvested the carrots once again. Which, 
I took out the front row of this because the water didn't go that far anyhow. And yeah, so that spot in the back there is room for the wire to go down. Uh, what did I say this was? Ten? One, two, three, four, one, two. Nine? And then at the tenth spot? Does that sound right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ow. So, it might look like ass by the time I'm done. Uh, I'm gonna... Yeah, that looks much better. I like that. One, two, three, four... Five, six, seven, eight, nine... Really? Yeah, and then there'll be one more. This tree is more in... I thought this tr these trees weren't going to be in the way, but apparently I thought wrong. I didn't put these here. These trees are actually naturally spawning, but... Man, there was four of those gigantic trees over here, and I cut some of them down to make way for the place. Bang. This should be eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yes, yes it is. And then I'm gonna do the same thing over here. Except for on this side I'm gonna have sheep, cow, and chicken. Pens. Uh, I'm not gonna bother with pigs because there's no real like need for them. So, basically, uh, I don't think I have enough fences on me. I didn't make a whole lot. I made enough for two pens worth, I believe. And then that was it. Actually, I don't think I have enough for two pens. But the thing I want to capture the most right now is the cows. Which, I don't think I have any wheat. So then there's going to be uh, wood walls between pretty much everything. I might put uh, fences. Oops, that's not the planks. I might do one layer like this and then put fences above it between these farms. And, yeah, I'm not 100% sure on that. I do know it's going to go one, two, three... Fence gate, fence gate, one, two, three. Uh, where are we at? Here? Oh. All right. Okay. So then these fences will go here, like so. And then uh, every single one of these pens will be done the same way. So I'm going to need fence gates here. And I'm just going to breed chickens and not make like one of the, the egg farm styles. Because, I mean, face it, the food and the feathers are pretty useful. And so I kind of want them. Okay, I almost have enough for all the pens. But basically, my goal is to make this look like a barn in the end. Right here. One, two, three, four, five. Five, six, seven. There we go. So, 
I mean, the general idea is... Yeah, pretty much I'm going to kind of make it look like a barn. These are going to be stalls. We're going to be larger to accommodate the uh, the Minecraft setting. I really want to get at least get the walls up for at least the cow pen. So that way I can get the cows in here. Not worry about them. Escape. Speaking of which, me and, if you remember, remember him... Uh, actually, I can't remember whether I actually recorded anything with him or not. Oh, right. If you watch the APB videos, you know him. Uh, Greg. Uh, we're going to be, well, we are actually already, working on making a map. It's going to be sort of like a, uh, Greg's original plan wasn't to have a story in it, but I decided I, regardless, at the end, I'm going to, like, make a story to sh fit it around the map. So, that's my whole plan with that. But, uh, yeah. So, hopefully, whenever that comes out, we do have a couple people in line for beta testing it. Uh, whenever we are at least moderately finished with it. And obviously we're going to do a playthrough ourselves to make sure that everything is working in its intended order. Uh, but we may look for some more people to beta test it for us afterwards as well. So, stick around for that. Um, so, right at the top of these, the roof's going to start curving over, and I might put, like, a ladder up one of these or something, um, probably this one, speaking of which, do one of those, ah, go there, okay, so it doesn't even, okay, I wondered whenever they put the, uh, the sideways logs in, how exactly they functioned, and apparently they are linked, uh, is, is this the third, oh, this is the third pen, I don't need this fence here, cool, whoops, uh, it's apparently based on the facing the block now, it didn't used to be quite as agreeable to place. <laughs> So, I missed that change whenever it happened. But, hopefully my 5 o'clock in the morning voice isn't too bad to listen to. Oh, and speaking of APB, we actually uploaded a uh, an episode last night. So, fun fun on that. Um, I probably don't have anywhere near enough resources to finish this. And I'm not even entirely sure how I'm going to do the roof. Um, here's a plan. So, this is going to go up to here for sure. Uh, yeah, this doesn't work if I don't actually have the floor complete. I'm going to do it this way. Ah! Well, I am going to want that. But not right at the moment. Craver. I was sad. You guys missed me getting the overkill achievement. Because of this ridiculous sword. This tree, it's in the way. Mostly. Not sure if I actually want... Uh, screw this idea.
It would make a lot of sense to me to put that there, but apparently I've decided I'm not going to. Okay, you. I'm sick of you. Die. Uh, that looks really weird. But we won't talk about things that aren't entirely complete yet. Hopefully, I don't drag this on too long. Uh, so I kind of want this to... I don't know if I'm going to use stairs for this. But as it gets closer to the, the top, I want it to start tapering off a bit. I might use half slabs to slow down the angle of attack on it. But I'm not entirely sure on that. Uh, the middle section is... Here? Yeah, if, I'm going to have to go with half, half slabs the whole way up, maybe. I definitely want it to, like, angle and turn a bit more towards the middle. It's going to be kind of difficult to build. What I should do is specify the maximum height I want it to go, which I think is five blocks from this point. So I think I want the maximum height to be right around there. Mm. Yeah, it's about where I want it, but I don't know how I'm going to taper this very well. There, there, there. Okay. Hopefully that should turn out. Somebody failed. I think it was me. I definitely want... I kind of want it to... Faster. I kind of want it to faster. The thing is, if I do this, then these need to get uh, longer. Eh. Hmm. That is going to look really funky. But you know what? I don't even care anymore. I don't even care. So, basically, the plan with this is... I'm... I'm probably going to make... Or I still I should still have some ladders. So I'm going to put some ladders on the inside, and there's going to be, like, uh, one little storage spot in the upper area. Ow. I heard it. I heard it coming. I didn't even bother moving. I was just kind of like, ah, crap. You know, technically, if I would have quickly switched my sword and blocked, I probably would have survived that. But, uh, I didn't do that, now did I? Oh, that son of a bitch blew a hole in my wall. Four, one, six, five, seven, two, three, dirt. Ah. These creepers are so annoying. Should hack in a command block to disable creeper uh, block destruction. No. Maybe a little bit overkill. Uh, 
and I lose anything other than a little bit of wood. Does not appear to be. So, this is the back side, so this is going to stay solid. Uh, the other side should look like that, only right in the middle of the upper area, uh, right where these beams would meet. There's going to be like a little windowy area. I haven't quite decided how I'm going to do these. I want to put like open barn doors here, but I haven't quite established how I'm going to do that yet. Yeah, I don't know. I'm just going to leave it open for now. Screw you, spider. So, I'm going to have to run that redstone line down the back. The thing is, I don't want to see it. So, I'm probably just going to do one of these maneuvers, where I just kind of block it off, like so. That looks really weird. I feel like I should do something about that. I do have kind of an idea but screw that for now. Uh, so I'm going to build that. Uh, the roof, I'm probably going to use uh, dark wood uh, spruce spruce slabs for the roof to give it at least a contrast. So uh, the next time you see this, it'll hopefully be done. Uh, this, I mean, it's something, there's not any two major, like, crazy design decisions in it. It's just designed to be a functional, you know, place to put the animals. It's not designed to be extremely amazing looking. So, just wanted to let you guys know and show you my general kind of design idea. So, and next time we come in, it's just kind of like, where the fuck did this come from? So, that is that. And, uh, you can see I flattened off the top of that tree at one point because I was going to tear it down and I didn't and now I'm going to anyhow. So, fun fun on that. Uh, but, uh, that's it for now. Automatic wheat farm. Automatic potato farm. Same exact way as I built the carrot farm. So I'm going to build those uh, off camera. Don't even ask why there isn't a redstone thing here, and I can't fix it, because I didn't leave myself any ores to fix screw-ups on the floor, so it's filled in with a block of wood at the moment. I made repeaters. And I had to make a new anvil, because my last one broke. Apparently they don't like being dropped very much. But, uh, I'm leaving it there for now. But, uh, enough of that. Like I said, you know, I will, st uh, yeah, yeah, I will see you guys next time. Have a good day.